To start off my last lecture, I'm going to talk about three lessons that I think everyone should consider. I believe that by following these three ideas, you could be a happier person and start living your life the way you want to. Nobody knows when your life could be over and I want to live my life being the happiest I could possibly be. The first lesson I have would be to stick to your beliefs and ideas. It doesn't matter what other people say or do. Do what's good for you and what you believe in. If someone tells you what you're doing is wrong, ask them how they know what is right. It's my life and I don't want to, someone to tell me how to live. What's the point of living if you're going to do it by someone else's rules? It's a waste of time if you're not doing what you want. If you're going to try to change other people's ideas or beliefs and they don't want to, just let it be. Don't worry about anyone but yourself and the people you love. You'll be much happier by not wasting your time on something that will never happen. No matter what you say or do, nobody's going to do something if they don't want to. I always try to stick to my beliefs and not tell other people how to live. My second lesson would be to never hold a grudge against anyone. If you hate someone and you spent your whole life, entire life wondering how miserable or better that person is, you're just hurting yourself and wasting your time. If you hate them so much, first think why. Why do I hate this person? Whatever your reason is, just let it go. There's nothing you can do to change what happened now. You would, you would feel a million times better if you didn't spend your time obsessing over why you hate this person. It would be like a weight lifted off your shoulders. Then you'll be thinking, wow, why did I ever waste my time hating her? Holding a grudge does nothing but make you unhappy. The, that person more than likely doesn't care if you hate them. You're using time that you can never get back. Why spend your whole life being miserable? That doesn't sound fun at all. Seriously, just forget about the grudges and move on. My third and final lesson is to appreciate everything you have. You never know when you or someone you love could die. I don't want to regret any last words I have to someone. Appreciate everything, no matter how big or small that thing may be. Be thankful for your life. There are a lot of people out there who have it way worse. I've heard that cancer kids are some of the most cheerful and happy people out there. I like to believe that's because they don't know if they're going to live or die so they can appreciate waking up each day. Never say it's just one day. Look at this day as if it might be the last one for you. Anyway, just appreciate and cherish everything you have, no matter how big or small or simple you think you think that thing might be, just be thankful. All in all, live your life how you want to live it. Don't let anyone dictate your life. It doesn't matter if you disagree or agree with anyone. They may not like it, but as long as you do, that's all that matters. People are really arrogant and judgmental, and if you let those kinds of people run your life, you should reevaluate. These three lessons are important to me, and I believe that people could be way happier by sticking to your beliefs and not changing them for anyone, not holding grudges against anyone because honestly, they don't care, and finally being thankful for every little thing that you have.